Three years ago today, the infamous McKinney pool party was caught on camera. A now former McKinney police officer taking down a teenager and creating a firestorm over police conduct. And now tonight, another pool party making and marking the anniversary of that event. So what happened when it came time for the party? Well, Aaron Jones live in McKinney now with the answer. Aaron. Steve, tonight's pool party was held here at the Apex Center. It's one of the city of McKinney's newest facility. There was food, there was a DJ, and there was a lot of fun to be had. But unfortunately, all of the teens who attended that original pool party did not show up here tonight. Tonight was supposed to be a celebration for them. Many of them graduated this year. Also, it was a chance for racial healing. Many of them still affected by the 2015 pool party. Cell phone video captured Corporal Eric Casebolt Bolt body slamming 15 year old Dejeria Becton. Casebolt resigned and never faced charges. Becton's legal guardian sued Casebolt, his department, and the city. It was announced last month that Becton received a $150,000 settlement. Tonight, her attorney, Kim Cole, and the Next Generation Action Network hosted this party. We wanted to create an atmosphere where children can come back out um, with peace, love, and harmony. They didn't get the opportunity to enjoy the original pool party. And because several of them graduated this year, I thought, what better way to celebrate? And anyone under 18 got in free tonight. Anyone older than 18 was asked to make a donation to a scholarship fund that's been set up for the teens affected by that original pool party.